Um, okay, but people will support the thing. <laughs> um, yeah, so basically I'm Romy, if you didn't know me. Um, I met Holly a couple of years ago when I arrived late to our first block meeting around four. <laughs> and I had to pick someone to sit next to, and I sat next to Holly, which I think in hindsight was pretty sensible. <laughs> um, and then in the past couple of years, I've been really lucky to have her as one of my campus friends. Um, yeah, and I think I will keep her short this week just because that was easy. Um, yeah, I thought I'd just say a few things that I've learned about Holly over, <laughs> over time. One thing um, that I'd start off with and weirdly like popped into my mind first when I sat down to think about it was that she's very opinionated. <laughs> um, whether it's matching shoes to a cocktail party dress, or mixing patterns, um, she's never been afraid to tell me when <laughs> her fashion choice is just clearly wrong. <laughs> um, and we had many an argument about art, and <laughs> basically whether or not Holly thinks the famous piece of art is just a bit shit. <laughs> Um, I've also learned that, well, over time I've come to see that she's both like one of the most organized and the least organized people I've ever met at the same That's time true. somehow. True. Um, yeah, she somehow keeps on top of like the million things that she does without ever reading an email. <laughs> I find this bizarre. Um, and she's notorious for hopping on the wrong bus. <laughs> And also just generally being like this with all my shopping. Yeah. Um, yeah, and also just generally being light. Yeah. Um, like somehow at the moment she's living literally next door to campus and somehow she managed to be late for an exam. <laughs> um, I've also learned that she really knows how to not take herself too seriously, which is something that I really appreciate. Um, She's clearly not afraid to shake off her whole bit of hair. <laughs> and also the occasional part of an eyebrow. <laughs> as, as she puts it, every other hair grows back from her experience. Um, and she's not, also not afraid to go to Halloween with me as half of an octopus costume. Try to use other half, which you can see up there. Um, her costume's so bad, we had to label it so that people could <laughs> understand what it was. And I'm sorry again for needing to tease her stuff pretty hard. <laughs> um, yeah, so I also thought I'd just say a few things, Holly, that I do really like about you. One of them um, is just kind of the honesty that I feel like you bring to everything. Um, and I feel like a lot of people who are honest about what I mean by that, like, just... I feel like you try to be really honest with yourself and in your relationships and and how you see the world and trying to understand what's going on in the world. Um, yeah, and it sometimes can be brutal honesty. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just think it's really refreshing and like something that I've learned from you, I've learned to try and really be more. Um, I also love that you're so kind of open and curious about like everything, about things, about people. Um, I feel like you're willing to have a conversation about anything, so you're just kind of like vibrating. Um, yeah, willing to go to a documentary with me about a hundred year olds in the world. Yeah, and I feel like I've had so many random interesting conversations with people just because I've been with you and we've been on the streets and then started talking into a random hostel and hung out and started talking to someone. Um, so I think that's really cool and I think it's also something that, yeah, from you, I kind of started to do a little more of as well. Um, yeah. And something that I've told you before, I feel like you, yeah, have this way of like seeing people and being with people and I think everyone around you kind of notices that and really appreciates that. Um, yeah, and it's something I just think about.
how you guys are gonna try to do things with people in the um, and yeah, and you can listen to for me and hope you know what I'm gonna say for you. Um yeah, and basically I love you a lot and I'm really excited for you guys to have a more like who you are and what you wanna do.